The metaverse may be the next generation of the internet and the next potential big technology platform. What makes it so promising is the chance it offers to combine physical and digital worlds in an immersive manner, further integrating our real world lives with our digital ones. That promise is bigger than just virtual reality. Most users will access the metaverse via mobile phones, not VR devices, which creates a huge opportunity. The metaverse could have around 5 billion total users by 2030, creating a target addressable market worth as much as $13 trillion. And it could change a lot more than gaming. The metaverse could transform everything from commerce to healthcare and education, and even how we collaborate. The metaverse could also change what counts as money. We think it's likely to include traditional currencies alongside digitally native ones, such as in-game tokens, stable coins, central bank digital currencies, and cryptocurrencies. That suggests a role for decentralized finance, or DeFi, a blockchain-based financial ecosystem that doesn't rely on banks, brokerages, or exchanges. But we think DeFi will likely coexist with traditional finance systems. And we shouldn't overlook digital assets, such as non-fungible tokens or NFTs. NFTs have become a hot commodity recently, but their impact has mostly been limited to social media bragging rights. In the metaverse, NFTs could be stored in a digital wallet, taken anywhere, and used in innovative ways, maybe even as collateral for loans. There's a lot to work out, but if the challenges of the metaverse are big, so too are its possibilities and its promise. Learn more in our City GPS report, Metaverse and Money, Decrypting the Future, available on our website.